is my great honor to share our CVPR paper, Indiscernible Object Counting in Underwater Themes. Indiscernible scene understanding has attracted a lot of attention in the vision community. We systematically study a new challenge named Indiscernible Object Counting, the goal of which is to count objects that are blended with respect to their surroundings. Due to a lack of appropriate datasets, we present a large-scale dataset IOC Fish 5K, which contains more than 5,000 images and 600,000 annotated center points. Furthermore, we propose IOC Former, a new strong baseline that can effectively track object counting under concealed scenes. Our presentation includes the following parts, introduction, dataset, method, experiments, and summary. Object counting is a fundamental task in computer vision. It aims to estimate the number of object instances in an image or video. The existing methods can be divided into two groups, generic object counting and dense object counting. The former is to conduct counting in everyday images, and the net is to count dense objects that can have up to thousands of instances. Recently, scene understanding for indiscernible scenes has attracted more and more attention. It is to understand the images or videos for which the foreground and background are similar. The traditional methods usually fail in this situation. The tasks include camouflaged object segmentation, camouflaged object localization, and so on. To the best of our knowledge, there is no work focusing on object counting in indiscernible scenes. In this paper, we systematically study this new problem. The difference between indiscernible object counting and the previous counting directions is shown in the right. Can you count the number of fishes in the given examples? In this paper, we contribute a large-scale dataset, IOC Fish 5K, containing more than 5,000 images and 600,000 accurate point labels. We also propose a lower approach. IOC formal, which achieves state-of-the-art results. Our images are all collected online. We collect online videos, extract images, and then conduct quality check. For image annotation, our annotation tools are developed on top of open source neighbor IMG. The annotation process includes the following steps train annotators, annotate images, and then conduct quality check and refinement. For more details about this part, please refer to our paper. This is the comparison between the proposed dataset with existing ones. The advantages of ours over existing datasets are as follows. First, IOC Fish 5K is the largest scale object counting dataset for indiscernible scenes. In terms of size, image resolution, and the number of annotated points. Second, IOC Fish 5K has a high density of images, which makes it currently the most challenging benchmark. Third, Although IOC Fish 5K is specifically proposed for IOC, it has some advantages over the existing DOC datasets. Last, IOC Fish 5K focuses on underwater scenes with sea animal annotations, which makes it different from all existing datasets. Here, we introduce our method. Existing methods for object counting can be grouped into two directions. First, counting by density, which is to estimate object density across the image. Second, counting by regression, which is to regress the coordinates of object centers. For IOC, 
The challenge is that the foreground objects are difficult to distinguish from the background due to their similar appearance. In this paper, we propose IOC formal by combining the benefits of density-based counting and regression-based counting. To be specific, we exploit object density map to make foreground objects stand out. As shown in this slide, our method integrates density-based and regression-based methods in a unified framework. Besides that, we also design a lower density-based transformer encoder so that the information from the density branch could be effectively integrated in the regression branch. For more details of our method, please refer to our paper. Here comes the experiments. For benchmarking purposes, we selected 14 mainstream methods for object counting and carefully evaluated them on IOC FISH 5K. Our method outperforms all existing approaches on this challenging dataset. From the experiments, we have the following observations. First, among all previous methods, the recent CLTR outperforms the rest due to the power of a transformer. Second, some methods like MAN and P2P-LED perform compactively on DOC datasets such as JHU++ and NWPU, but perform worse on IOC FISH 5K. Third, the methods which propose new loss functions for current counting including BL, Lloyd's CC, DM count, and GL, perform well despite being simple. In this slide, we compare quantitative results between our method and some existing approaches. To sum up, in this paper, we provide a rigorous study of a new task named IOC. To facilitate its progress, we present a high quality dataset, IOC Fish 5K, with underwater scenes. Furthermore, we provide extensive benchmarking experiments for the new task and a new method to solve it, which achieves state of the art performance. Thanks for your attention.